is up my Skyrim family it's your long lost son Jelly Bean how's everybody doing this crazy crazy time I hope everybody's staying safe today we're gonna to be looking at something rather unusual um, it's not really lore friendly textures incredible textures absolutely insane textures it's it's a good it's a beautiful house let's just say it's a masterpiece but if you're looking for lore friendly this house definitely not is not it so what am I talking about I'm talking about the house behind this is called Arden house so once you download the mod you can automatically fast travel so let's go over there and take a look shall we so you got this beautiful beautiful walkway as you come up it's absolutely beautiful so let's go there we go that's a little better but look at this the textures and the work is absolutely incredible so once you get to the house you come up to this door it took me a little bit to find it because I was looking for a safe, because he said a safe, but it was actually a strong box. So right here is where you're going to find the key. So there's the entrance, right there. So we're going to take a little look around the property, at, at all the beautiful, beautiful textures. Like, it is absolutely incredible. This must have taken the mod author forever. Of course, we come through here, through the gate, and look at this. Look how beautiful this is. It is. It's absolutely gorgeous. Just everybody's going to be saying, Oh, it's not lore friendly, blah, 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 blah. I know it's not lore friendly, but it is a vision. It is a mod author's vision. Something that the mod author has put time and effort in for us to enjoy. And I'm enjoying every second that I'm wandering around here. Just looking at all the beautiful textures. Now this is your smithing area. You got some str oh, what do we got in the strong boxes? Ooh, we got money, money, money. You got your workbench and your forge. But look at the, look at this incredible texture here on the on the groundwork around the trees. Like look how beautiful that is. Just absolutely gorgeous. You know, I love it when mod authors think outside the box and they present you with such an incredible piece of art. And that's all I can say. It's, it's a piece of art. It's a masterpiece. It is the mod author's vision of what he enjoys, what he loves, what he wants to bring to us, the players. Now, of course, over here you got a stable for three horses. There's only two horses in there right now. But look at, look at the, we got to get closer to these horses. Look how realistic that those horses look. Look at how incredibly beautiful they are. Oh, just absolutely beautiful. So there is a guest house right there for your follower or your companion or whoever you would like to stay there out here you have a small garden you know just a little garden to grow some vegetables you have this beautiful little sitting area like it, it is like it is an absolutely gorgeous gorgeous house Like, you have to really appreciate when a mod author goes through this much work to present such a beautiful work. You wish it well. Over here you have some ingredients for your alchemy and all your potion needs. Just beautiful. And then you have this other little gateway. Look at the detail about the gate too, and that little light up there. I guess it's a light. So this thing's 
basically we've gone right in a complete circle. So what we're going to do is we're going to look at the guest house and then we'll go into the main house. And everywhere you look, there's all these little planters for your alchemy ingredients. But let's get inside the guest house, shall we? So here we are, we're inside the guest house. And look how just absolutely beautiful this is. Like, I cannot imagine how long it takes some of these mod authors to make such beautiful houses. They work so tirelessly, so there's a plug. Support your local mod author for all the hours of enjoyment that they give us. We got a nice little sitting area over there, like we saw with the table. Look at a beautiful rug. So over here, they can come in here, sit with their mead, get the cooking pot just to brewing. Oh. I just love all the details. Like, it's just incredible. Then, of course, they have their own little bedroom. A little storage chest. You can store some stuff. Another rug there in the corner. Some stuff you can take to sell if you'd like. So it's a, it's a great little, you know, just a nice little, little home away from home, a little comfy cottage type thing. So that's basically it for the guest house. So let's head over to the main house, shall we? So here we are, we're in the main house now. And the beautiful textures just continuing throughout. Now I love the color scheme. The color scheme seems to go so well together. Like, that's beautiful. So you do have a mannequin over here where you can put some your armor and some bookshelves. And then in here you got like a little dining table, some food already set up. Oh, look at this. You can even take the food. So if you're playing survival mode, there's some mode. There's some free food. And I love these pictures. Look how vibrant and colorful these paintings are. So there's not really much in this area. That just leads back out to Skyrim. You have a little display case here where you can put your treasured uh, your treasured weapon. I'm having a hard time speaking today. Another mannequin, he's hiding in the trees. He's pretending he's camouflaged. Coin pours. Oh, you can take it. Nice little sitting area. Read a good book. I love these windows. These windows are absolutely beautiful. And then you open this door and you got this beautiful staircase leading upstairs. And then just look at the height. Look at the height. Like, wow. And then even the treads on the stairwell. Then you come through this little hallway with beautiful curtains. Now there is an alchemy lab, but unfortunately I couldn't find it. Nice little fireplace sit here. Ooh, a oil cream tree. Not sure what that is, but it sounds good. It sounds really appetizing. So this here is your enchanter. Of course, the bookshelves are all full. You can there you go. You can get some books if you like. Yeah, with the beautiful, beautiful curtains. But like I said, I love the color scheme. He, the mod author, really hit it on the, right on the note. Like the color scheme is just. Perfect. It just seems so great together. So, of course, through here you got the master bedroom. 
Got some fancy duds there. What's in the end table? Ooh. Some treasures. Look at this beautiful bed. Absolutely beautiful. Of course, you got your little desk here where you can do some uh, finances, taking care of the property. And again, with those vibrant pictures. Oh, I love those pictures. So basically, ladies and gentlemen, that is Arden House. If you've enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up. The algorithm will love you. I'll love you. Everyone will love you. Don't forget to smash that subscribe button. Move your mouse a little to the right and hit that bell icon so you'll be notified each and every time I upload a video. And always remember, wherever the journey takes you, may the road rise up to greet you. I'm Jellybean, and thank you so very much for watching.